we've been seeing a lot of eight ball but i'll be bringing back the 10 ball and the nine ball on my channel i know that you guys are predominantly nine ball and ten ball players so i'm expecting here that you'll be looking forward to the matchup the rematch up between shane and i and it's coming very soon in a couple of weeks so shane don't worry i'll be coming back for you sir so gear up and get ready gear up and get ready because i'm not gonna lie down and just allow you to damage me no way so shane taking his second bathroom break there and we all know that the first and the last rock is always the most challenging one to win shane has a commanding a commanding nine three lead i remember shane and i had a matchup like this where i really I, I think I defeated Shane 10 to 2. So he's finally getting his revenge after a couple of years. And that's what proves that patience is a virtue. Unsuccessful break there by Shane. Maybe this is a consolation rock. Maybe just to remove a little bit of the embarrassment. I should be able to run out this rock. Solid seems to be the opening pot here. 13 ball looks a little bit tricky there on the side so that alone lets me know that I don't want to take the stripes Doesn't seem as if I have an opening shot here on the stripes either. I do have the cut on the 14 But definitely going for the solids. This is like the premier option here So playing the six it looks like into the side Moving that three ball nicely done Getting the four into the side. Or the two into the side actually. Okay, so I'm going for the four instead. Oh dear, is that a mistake? Yeah, the smile. The smile, the smile. Actually, the angle was too acute. And basically snookering myself here. Leaving myself with a tough pot. Well, not snookering, obviously, but leaving myself here with a tough pot. Not the right time to make these kind of error apex. So let's see, you're going for the two maybe into the side. Or the two into the corner. I think I'm going for the two into the corner. Rolling in this. All right, let's see here. Staying focused, staying down, staying steady. Two ball into the corner. Nicely done. Nice recovery shot here by Apex. No matter how tough or how challenging the match may be, you still got to play the game and ensure that you play to the best of your ability and fight to the end. I strongly believe in fighting to the end. Do not give up because it seems as if you're going to lose. Stay strong, stay focused in the game because it just takes a spark to get a fire burning. So let's see here. Really don't want to have to move this fire because it is my insurance. But I don't have an option here. Playing position for that one ball, getting the problem out from now. So pretty good shot there by Apex. Maybe this is a consolation rock. So I'm looking now, I have the natural angle here, I know that this particular system, the Ralph Eckert positional system here, lets me know, you see where I put the chalk? Once I cut this one ball in, with a natural cue ball, I should hit about where the chalk is, and head into the line of the three. So you'll see here that I land perfectly there on the chalk, nicely done. Position is still clean. Still trying to play the best of my ability here. I have the seven. Stunning and coming up one reel. So I can even roll forward for the eight into the side. If I have it straight in, I can stop. For the 8 into the corner, you'll see that I'm looking at the tangent line. <coughs> <laughs> so 
So playing the 7 here. Oh dear, dear. Still, was trying to hold it, but I think that the ideal shot here. I'm not even so certain. But it's on the hill. Shane is on the hill. So it's a lot of pressure. A lot of pressure here. Really don't have much of an option here. Definitely not the best match. Didn't really get into the game. Played a quite not it's not a lot, but Shane was just really good in this match. I don't have much of a choice here. I have a really thin cut here on the A. So let's see if I maybe can just pull one last shot off. Oh, great shot there by Apex. Great shot there. Great recovery shot. Lovely run out there by Apex. Nice break and run. Well, not a break and run, but a run out. So, consolation prize there. Four rocks. Shane is on nine. It's time for us to get down. Can Shane cross the line? Can Shane go over the finishing line? Will Apex be able to come back? Can a couple of rocks flicker, off, flicker a few feathers in Shane's game? Shane knows that he needs to get over the line sooner rather than later. All I do is work, work, work.